Good on her. You are so perfect for her size-wise. Good, honey. <laughs> Beautiful seat. Okay, that's great work. Hey, you're sitting on yours. I'm not even sitting on my four-year-old yet. I'm with you. Go have fun. I'm not going to pick on you. I'm, oh, we're just kidding. <laughs> Go do your thing. I'll just try to keep it to a mild comment here and there. All I can tell you is on a four-year-old, be as clear and definite as you can be, right, in a quiet way. Go. Yeah. No bangers. Well, and you just gave into it. Why did you? That's the one. You know, I got it. I saw it before you even ride your horse as well as you can. No. Make her go, though. You have to give her the feeling that you'll go take her down to the Alpo factory if she doesn't do what you ask her to. You missed our first lesson. lesson. Ask Holly about intention. Holly will set you straight now. Okay? Intention. Your intention, you have to be a thousand percent committed. This time I expect you to walk past this door with her asking to trot. You're already looking at the ground. What is it, something in the water here? Look up. Okay, giddy up. She can step bigger than that. Yes, ma'am. Keep the reins short. Don't go so close to the door. Don't tempt her and be looking out that door. Be thinking, we're going to go gallop out that door right now. Gallop to that door. Yes, think that. Don't do it. And look at the difference that makes. So you see, what you're thinking makes a huge difference, doesn't it? Now, I can already tell you want to cross your hands all over creation, all that damn racetrack stuff you did. Keep the left hand on the left side and the right hand on the right side, no matter what. Okay? So if you want to turn left, it's the left rein only. The right rein plasters down into her withers. If you want to turn right, only the right rein turns her right. The left hand stays on the left side, plastered down into her withers. And you too, sweetie. You're thinking small. You're on a big horse. She can take twice as big a steps as that. You are holding her back. Yes, it's hard work to ride her at the walk. You should already be sweating. Yes, push hard. She'll do anything you want. She couldn't be lovelier. I wouldn't go too close to that camera first try. Look this way. Don't buy into her game. Make her come back to yours. Giddy up. There's the door you're galloping out of. Are you looking at it? No. There's a drop fence that you have to ride over there. Look at it that way. Giddy up. Giddy up. Giddy up. Yes, and once you've got that monster conquered, now start looking across and saying, look, horse, get a work ethic and let's get on with it. She's even looking out that door. See the intention there, you guys, Holly? You see that? Marike is like, yep, yeah, that's where we're going because that's where Patty. Don't whip her, sweetie, because you were focusing. I'm sorry, I needed to talk to you more. That's okay. That's okay. Let me give you a little help there. Let me help you know. Keep riding. Let me help you understand. I Over here, I told you, you're going to gallop out that door, yeah. right? And the good student that you are, you committed, she committed so heavily to that thought. This is where Patty and I have a magic. I haven't taught her a lesson in 30 years, but this is where we have always had a magic. When I say do something, man, she does it in spades. And she had Marike convinced that you were going out the door. And so it overwhelmed her. And that's why I started to jabber about looking across the arena. And I got busy talking here and I should have stayed with you because she's very sensitive. And she was focused on out that door, even though you were passing it, but she's focused on it because you asked her to be. So we don't want to give her a whip when she goes, uh-oh, because she still is like, aren't we going out that door? Don't you know there's stuff out there? Now look across. Don't look out there. Look, and get her looking across. Don't go so close to the door. No whipping. Whipping just makes a scared horse more scared. Stubborn is one thing. Scared is another. Never reprimand a scared horse. Now, you have to understand whether they're scared or not, but especially if they're young, just getting started, keep the whipping at a very, very minimum. Easier said than done, but if you can't do that, drop the whip. Good. Left hand on the left side, right hand on the right side. Good. Keep that big steps. And then I'm bored, so I know she is. Change direction, do different stuff. Turn around, do a circle, halt here, walk there, just do stuff. But keep it going more. You're sucking back into a lack of confidence and a lack, lack, lack. Grab for it. Go get what you want. 
you're on a big horse that can do it she's really nice i don't like frisians but she's i like her more than any i've ever seen before and i'll say that and i i don't say that without meaning it because it's even on video and don't taunt her now with the scary door. Look across and do something else. Go somewhere else. You've got some cones here. Scream at them to get out of your way. I don't know, whatever. But keep the steps big. Get her engaged and focused on you and what you're doing. Big steps. Come on. Mm -hmm. And I said the word come on here, but know that when you're riding a horse and you say come on, they're hearing ho. You have to. Walk on. Yeah, walk on. I'm making noise. Woo! We're making all kinds of scary noises. Woo! It's so loud in here. And remember, I've got the megaphone going, the speaker. So this is something to learn. Horses, it's not that they're afraid of this sound or that sound. They get to a decibel level and one decibel over that, and they do a spookaboo. So thank you. Yeah, they did great because they also felt my intention. I became a security blanket instead of a threat. Initially, every horse that walks in here is like, oh God, because oh, they feel my energy, they hear my loud voice, and they don't know what to make of it. But then they start to see that I'm on their team, the riding gets better, they start putting it all together. They don't think about it, but they feel it. Right, Holly? They don't look at it, they feel it. Good. Big steps, honey. Big steps. Don't be scared of her. Shorten those reins and get on with it. Sit down a little bit. Sit back a little bit. So if she does a stupid, you're behind the motion a little bit. Don't let her look to the right anymore. Don't let her look left or right. She needs to look right in between the middle there, okay? She's ready for all this. I'm not asking you for anything she's not ready for easily. Bigger steps. You're the one sucking back. She's happy to go, but you're not sure. That's nicer even. Had a girl. And then, you know, do something else. With your seat, good job. Nice, nice downward transition. Keep, yeah, it's okay. You did it correctly, and she's so busy being distracted, she tripped. It's a baby thing, so what? And too much about the whip, I would just leave the whip wherever you have it, Pat, and just quit messing with it. She doesn't like that, and she doesn't need it. She doesn't even need a whip. Good. Good, and just keep doing stuff so that she stays with you. She's a very intelligent horse, so she needs to be kept busy. Mentally busy. Yeah, good girl. And whenever she's a good girl, or even if she's nervous, good girl. Good girl. Big, long, loud, good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Nice, good girl. Keep the big steps happening, not the little silly pony steps, big old Frisian steps. Yeah, it's a girl. Take some deep breaths yourself. Do you see how the breathing comes into play here, guys? If she would take some huge breaths. Yeah. No looking in the mirrors. You're not allowed that luxury yet. That's a girl. You got too much to focus on here. Good, but you learned a good thing about her today. I mean, she will focus where you focus. So you best be concentrating because she was totally up for doing that drop fence out the door. She, she was on it, babe. Good. Bigger steps, honey. Don't pull her back to a pony stride. Let her learn from the get-go to go forward and big. Yes, and when you do that, look what she wants to do. She wants to reach down and forward to the bit. She's going to trip, so what? More. Come on, more. Giddy up. Just say, chop, chop, chop. That's enough. Yeah, that's enough. No harassment, just enough. And now she's going to say, oh, God, everyone's leaving. That's all right. I might let her walk while everybody leaves the arena. Good girl. That's okay. Patter, patter, patter. It's okay. Good, good. It has to all be positive at this age. No more whipping, okay? All positive. Huh? Yeah, bring it over here and drop it if you can. You don't need a whip with her. You need intention. Intention and video and on mirrors and understanding to go forward. She doesn't need a whip. She doesn't need spurs. She needs a heart that's very, yeah, just drop it. Up. Don't fling it. I wouldn't have done it. Don't fling. Everything's a threat. Yes. Good girl. She's a good girl. And try to give her rub-a-dubs whenever you can. A 
love this whip, fancy spoiled girl. This is an Allison whip. <laughs> Good. I'm going to peek at my message. Okay, I got a problem. Okay, my brother's not good. Let it be big, 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 big. It's hard work to do it right, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, without weapons, yeah. But your horse is, okay. And that's fair, so I understand the whip now, but I'd rather see somebody be on the ground. And today you have me. But I bet Amanda would be happy to help you. And I bet Holly would be happy to help you. I love them, by the way. Fuck them. Good girl. Fuck them. You ask her. And I'll just be here to say you have to. Look across. Look where you're going, not where you are or have been. Big. Think big. Big. And you can do a little discipline just with the leg and body if she is at that. And you've asked her to go big and she didn't. That's when you dig your heel in a little and say, excuse me. Okay. Okay. But, you know, she's almost done for her session here, isn't she? She gets about three or four more minutes, and that's all she's got, and that's all she needs. And she's shown improvement already. Let her come down like that. Most Frisians won't, sweetheart. When she wants to come down, by all means, let her. Out to the rail. Out to the rail. Gently but firmly out to the rail. Welcome. And make sure you get your signals really clear with her. I think I'm coming back here in September, and I'm going to try to stay four or five days if I can, so you and I can put together a program for you if you want to. Okay. She's nice. I like her a lot more than I ever have on the phone. She is pretty. She's not Frisian-y Frisian. If we pulled her mane and trimmed her up, you wouldn't know. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. What did you say? I said if we pulled her mane and trimmed her up, you almost wouldn't know. Uh -huh. Inside leg more than outside, right? Don't just thump on her. Yeah, and then halt. So I will give you credit. I'm going to let you carry your whip again and just carry it, right? And don't change sides with it. Da -da. No stress itches. Da -da. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. That's a good girl. See, it's just like Tango. She loves the cuddle bear. No cuddle bear right now. Yeah, okay. Off you go. So let's do this. Let's, you see how I have these cones coming down the center line. Let's just do a little round of come down the center line in the trot. I know it's asking a little bit, but I'll, I'll make them nice and wide. And you have to go. Can you do it at the walk? That's all right. It's a new noise. So let's focus this way. She's focused on the drop fence that we were, yeah, down the middle. And when you get to that end, turn right and do it again, turn left. Big steps, big steps. Especially through the turns. Teach her that as she approaches a turn, a curve, her steps get bigger, bigger, bigger. And then just support her on the long side. And as you, ooh, this is a nasty turn. If you can, don't worry if you miss it, don't worry. Good, you made it, good, I love it. Now support, 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 push, 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 push through the turn. Trot, trot, good girl, trot, good girl. Let her relax now, nice, push a little bit. Push her to the bridle, keep her straight in the hand. There you go, that's the feeling we want, you feel that? Yeah. When she comes down to that, that's what you want. Push down the middle, push. Good girl, just give me this two or three more times through the middle, we'll quit, okay? This is nice. Nice, push, push, come on, push through the turn. Look up and push. You have three reins, the inside rein, the outside rein, and your eyes. Where are your eyes telling her to do? Where are they telling her to go? Yes, trot, trot, trot. It's a tight turn, God bless, you can do it. Look this way, look the way you wanna go. Look up, help her, push her through it, push her, support her through it. Yes, ma'am, beautiful, push. One, two, one, two, one, two, push through the turn. One, two, big steps, big steps, big. Come on, lazy pony. Atta girl. Yep, somebody's not in shape, huh? All of us. One more time and we call it a day. Yes, don't let go of anything, though. Support her when she goes down there, honey. You want her to fall into your hand and you want to hold her up. That's what you want. Don't drop her when she goes down. Support her. Push. Push hard. We are asking her to stretch down. She's doing it. So when she does, 
Hold on to her and let her lean on your hands when she's there. Don't give up the ring, okay? Keep going again. We're not done yet. I lied. Don't club to her constantly, only once in a while. Teach her to work from your body, your eyes up and across. Up, up, up. See how you stop her, sweetie, when you look down? Yeah. Yeah, look up. And the littlest word that you say, she interprets as H-O. Push, giddy up, come on, use your stomach, use your back, use your seat. Have intention, good. She's had enough. Now sit and walk. If you trust her, drop the reins, if you trust her to do it, and be done. That's enough for today. Very good. How is that compared to what you've been doing? Does it? Good. She can itch now. We're on rest. When the reins are dropped, we're allowed.